Hey y'all, how y'all doing? If y'all new here, yes, my name is Jordan. This is Jacob Wild Vlog. So, y'all, I know I've been gone for two whole weeks. Literally, today make two weeks. So sorry about that. I've been going through a lot, and I might do a like life update video we're gonna see we're gonna see but this past week i have been moving i moved out of my first ever apartment i've been living with a friend for a week and i'm moving to my apartment tomorrow before y'all get to see my new crib and the whole process of me getting to my new crib um i just want to record the whole process or i did record the whole process of me moving down my last place and that's why this video is but 40 some minutes long. I didn't have to make it up to y'all. So I'm dropping this a big banger. Okay, 40 minutes, y'all. 40 plus minutes. I was looking crusty and dusty 95% of this video. This is just your warning. This is the disclaimer. So let it just be known right now. Other than that, make sure y'all follow me on my medias. And we really finna go straight into the video. Um, I think I started off with me literally just start packing stuff. I pick up the camera, start recording, and this we're gonna start off it. So see y'all there. So but let me just give y'all a rundown of what everything's looking like. So this living room that's going upstairs in our house. And this is the downstairs bedroom. <sighs> Child, just get into it. So we did have someone about living in this room. But she already moved out even though we had like another month to live here. If y'all don't know, I was doing my, what it is, my blush mark collab in this room. And being here and recording the video definitely gave me an idea of how well my recording studio will be in my next place. But this was kind of the setup. Um, my friend clothes is right here. She just came back from drill. And this is all my stuff. Most of this stuff was in my car, if not all of this was in my car. And I had to throw it in here because I'm packing up stuff in my room. So to bring all this in my room where I'm trying to pack stuff down and move it out my way would not make sense. So boom. That is how this look in here. And yeah, this is how our living room is looking like. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, it is definitely junky. And I know y'all seen me like clean my apartment up probably like two months ago or probably was even a month ago. It's gonna be dirty. Like I feel like we are at the point of no return with this apartment stuff because we're always packing stuff. We're always getting packages. Like these two packages just came in, I think that's my bed and stuff because all of us is moving. And then over here, those are my bar stools, my laundry basket that my boyfriend still haven't taken upstairs for me. And then it's like a little side table. Oop, this little side table for my house, like when you first walk in. So right now, I'm gonna put this box together. We are finna to pack some stuff up, okay? And yes, I'm gonna just use this box to pack some of my shoes up because honestly they are just laying around causing havoc y'all this footage right here is gonna be all over the place and it's gonna be like the lighting not gonna be awesome and me holding this freaking camera is not gonna be awesome but it's okay we're gonna start tackling this okay y'all this is the closet of notre dame this is narnia Okay, got one box done. I got the two things, it was our basket. This hold all like my blankets and everything in my room. Got all my little plushies and rose bears. There's another one under there. That was Sunday got me. I think it was Sunday one of these at uh, arcade thing in Jackson. And he won this one at up there also. And my vinyls. And it looked gold ottoman thing. So it's kind of the first box right here and the room still look disgusting so yeah let me show y'all what we did okay don't mind this because that's just my school stuff but i picked out all these clothes all right these are my electronics and i put my school supplies in there i don't know what i'm doing with this occasion just yet but my mirror um, I ain't gonna lie, we still got all the dirt clothes right there, but who cares? But look, my rack is gone. Uh, I'm definitely gonna go order like the little thing to hide the cords for my room and the living room in my next place. That just kind of how this place is going. It's, it's organized though, you see? 
That's why right there is so nasty, but my bed. I'm just showing them how much I've done in this room. I folded all yeah, the clothes. Told you so. I made the bed. I got rid of my shoe things, pack my shoes up. Oh, I showed y'all was in this, this box. I just didn't want to put it out there because I already have a lot of stuff out there. Um, clean this off, wipe it down myself. Child, look at my head. I ain't something, I got a whole boyfriend out here and my head looking like this. Cause she want me to get it done. She said she independent. Dang, but sometimes people who have um, love language of active kindness, they don't want your help, but they don't need your help, but it just be nice for you to just offer Well, every it bitch that I do. choose to braid your hair, you talking about it's ugly. Cause they should be ugly. Y'all look. I don't think I ever just showed y'all like my house. But like. But yeah, I don't think I ever showed y'all upstairs. But when you first come up the stairs, you see all of my mess. This is my clothes bin. I just folded down a whole lot of clothes and I still gotta go through these. And then I also got like 17 more loads to put on, so that's great. These are some of all my packages. That's trash, this is a suitcase. I gotta go pick that up. This is my rig that I just broke down. And then you come into my room, where you see the ugly son, I mean my beautiful boyfriend. And then this the rest of the upstairs because I don't think I ever showed y'all. And then look at our door. Look at our door. So she got KAG for her initials. And then she got DTL for her initials. And I have a JKY. And I had more roses on my yeah. excuse me. This is NBA Finals. Um, uh, but I'm I'm recording. <laughs> I can't stand you. So yeah, I put more flowers and had like all this coming out like a little 3D thing, but somebody knocked them down. Y'all yeah, look so rough, it's so sad, but yeah. Oh, another thing that we did up here is everybody got a picture. So this is moi. This is my other roommate. <laughs> and bro, Kayla's is the funniest of all. My mama thought it was so cool when I put these up, y'all. So I'm going to wash my tail, order some cookies and ice cream from Insomnia, and lay down. Lay down. So I love y'all. Thank y'all for coming for this dream with me today, cleaning up my room and starting the packing process. I'm looking real rough. Let me get off this camera, y'all. Bye. Hey, um. Okay, so it is currently like 10:30. At night, it's like three days after I filmed that last part. And now I gotta move all this stuff out of this room by the time, by the morning time. So that's fun. But she's getting her floor like done tomorrow. So I have to get all this stuff out now. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna sit and go through this paperwork and put like a pile of things that I need to keep and things I'm gonna throw away. Um, I'm not recording because I don't want any information to be shown on the camera, so just give me a second. So today, my biggest thing is getting all these clothes together, child. They're my dirty clothes. Uh, I'm gonna show y'all the method I'm doing when I um, go downstairs, but for right now, I know that this is my pro my top priority is getting all this clean, getting this all packed. Um, and then also, I have this bin, this is clean clothes that we been start packing up. But the thing is right now, with this bin, like look, this is that bin right here. This is the same bin that I brought all my clothes in when I first moved to my dorm. Easy, I had the top on everything, it was cool. And then I moved this over here to my new apartment and it was still fairly good. But I've been moved to my next unit and over this past year I've done hauls, I received clothes and everything. I mean, I do fashion content. Y'all, I have too much clothes and even though I go through these clothes like on a regular base, I have not decluttered it. 
pretty sure it's something I, in there I can like give away and throw away and everything, but so I have not, I have not. So we'll have to go through that again, make sure everything's folded down, get that paint down today, wash all the clothes, and I'm gonna start on my closet. I'm gonna start, okay. Um, this is my top for RIT for today. Tomorrow, we'll probably start taking everything down off my walls. For right now, honestly. Okay, I'm going to show y'all how I'm washing these clothes and the process of me getting all this packed down. So, let me tote these downstairs and then we're going to catch up back down there. So, yeah. Alright. I probably think that was terrible. <laughs> it probably was terrible, but... We are downstairs. Let me get this TV off, child. Okay, boom. So, we are downstairs. And I'm just trying to show y'all, like, my washing clothes method. Because I have a lot of clothes. And I don't tend to wash my clothes how it's supposed to be washed. Or, I don't know. I procrastinate, child, when they come down to my clothes. So, <laughs> this is the tea. These are dirty clothes. This is dirty clothes. That's their clothes. That's their clothes. So these two big piles right here is what I just brought down. Basically, what I'm doing is the washroom is right. It's right here. This is the washroom. <laughs> so that's the washroom. So I brought all my clothes down here, and I'm just taking two days to do load after load after load after load after load. After load. And it's just easy because our biggest thing living here with like the upstairs downstairs unit. And the washer being on the down floor, we being upstairs, is the fact of toting all our clothes down, toting all your laundry detergent stuff down. And again, I said I live with three other people, so it wasn't it wasn't best for us to just leave our like detergent stuff down here because we our washroom don't have like no storage or anything in it. Like this the washroom slash Wi-Fi room, child. Um, yeah, so we sometimes put our stuff right here on the floor. But other than that, put it on top of the washer. When the washer is going, it's going to knock your stuff down. And we didn't want to put too much stuff on the floor. So we didn't want to get it mixed up. And we didn't want people using our stuff. So you bringing all your clothes down. You bringing all your detergent down constantly. And you have to come up and down, up and down. Couldn't dry it on. Couldn't wash it on. Tore your clothes back up. Put some up. It was just too much. So to make this process very easy, I just put all my dirty clothes down here. But yeah, wash the clothes, and then I sit on the couch. Just another set of clothes that just came out the dryer, and I got this other bin that I had just bought, and I just folded up, put it in there, and I have a duffel bag over there of stuff that I want to take within like this week break uh, from us moving into our unit and from moving back here because I don't want to have to go in and out of these containers, messing up my folded clothes. Okay. Okay, my camera had died right then. Yeah, that's um the process of today. Me and all these clothes washed and packed. I also washed some of my clean clothes too because they smell like closet. And I don't know, just washing it and everything. Trying to get some of that bad juju of this house off before I move into my next unit. And then, I should cut that off because I hate the like, fan sound. So, the next thing I want to show y'all that I think I have not showed y'all yet. And if you see my apartment cleaning video, you knew how bad this is. Y'all, this is the after. Like, I don't even know y'all can tell how this closet look then. But get into it, okay? So, this is my boyfriend's bass head. He was on the Pride, um, like the, the school drum team thing. Like, he was in a band, he played drum, yeah. So this is drum here. I think this is from his last game. So that's cute. He's gonna bring that with him. Um, it's something on the other side. These two suitcases, I think I'm gonna keep this one. And my mom helped me move in, so I'm gonna send it back with her up north. Um, this is just some shoes, extra tripod. This is our accent table when you first walk in the house. And it's literally it. Like that's all that's in there. And that's like um, I think there's extra school supply. Cause I am in college, y'all. But y'all, y'all should be so freaking proud of me. That is shoes. That is completely all shoes. And I probably have like two boxes worth of shoes. And this is just random stuff. So we got blanket. We have some um, accent pillows that we probably don't use because they have like pink in it. 
and it have gold and i don't think we doing like we definitely doing pink in our next apartment and the gold probably clashed because everything's kind of like a silver and there's just some more gold stuff from my dorm that i brought here that did not use that is my white and gold record player some canvas just a whole lot of stuff my snorkel kit because the girl was a marine biology major and i just changed my major i don't think about doing like a life update video but child we'll see so that's basically it and then upstairs y'all probably seen it in the earlier clip we have like all our new um newly bought things from amazon up there by our room it was in my room but then things start getting hectic when i start buying like the big things like the chairs the table and so we sit outside so oh my god i feel like i've been talking so much that's the clip we run down i'm gonna separate these clothes in um dark colors another pile that i really just don't know what to call it and then white so let me do that and we're gonna start this washing up so we can get packing so Alright y'all, so I just separated them into piles. Let me kind of explain to y'all what I did. So I got all my colored clothes. So that means all my pinks, purple, greens, yellow, blues. Like all my vibrant color that I don't want to fade is right here. Then this is of course all black pile, all my dark colors. Sometimes I wash my jeans with my dark colors. Um, and sometimes I don't. So of course you gotta have your white separate and i've learned to not wash my towels with my clothes um yeah i don't know where i was going with that but that's basically <laughs> yeah so i don't wash my towel with my clothes i got a, a towels clothes a color clothes load all black and then these are like my tans my nude and some jeans um these colors like if they fade we actually probably do the colors and justice so yeah look like my grays my browns my tans um i find myself to be a very diverse clothes wear like i wear colorful clothes i wear a lot of dark and i wear you know some nudes so um uh, like right now i got on shit all black but probably it, tomorrow or later on today i probably have on a bright yellow dress so it really don't matter so this is it right with this i'm gonna get started with this and i'll just let y'all know the next time i start picking up something um because this is gonna take a while so yeah so see y'all then um next i definitely gonna do my closet but we just gonna pretend like i didn't say that and continue watching hey y'all hey y'all how y'all doing it is currently 11 11 perfect timing i guess things on my own um, sure don't, don't worry about that but y'all, this is later on in the same day, we went to the pool. It was very fun. Y'all, I learned how to swim on the six feet, but that's not the purpose of this clip. The purpose of this clip is the nacho fries are back. So right now I'm going to start taking down all the little things like all this. I think I'm going to start taking that down. yeah and gonna start packing up my clothes in the closet and just screen out my closet but that's really it let's go check in with d because i see that her light is on so yo who's up for some cups or a pool it was a dick hey youtube you know getting my rooms together to move so see y'all with the complete move out it's over no ma'am <laughs> Here, let me go to Kayla's room. It's a. Oh, now you heard me coming. Oh, yeah, this is my room. Welcome to my crib. <laughs> really? That's what I was thinking. I was gonna take down my decoration off my wall, but I'm like, I haven't did like the tour yet, so would that matter or. No. You know, I had decorations on my wall. This is my um, 
Jacuzzi. Yeah, that's a real Gucci type. It's important from <laughs> um, Italy. Not Italy. Okay, so hopefully my camera don't pick up on the music because we bought the music right now. But right now, I'm probably gonna take down these pictures and stuff because mm, <laughs> it just I just gotta get stuff done. And I've been supposed to record this um house tour. Alright, so on my wall I have the picture is female. I supposed to have like a lot of paintings and like a little art wall right here above my vanity, but I didn't care that much. Honestly, like, honest to God. Uh, we got this done in Jackson. It's of me and my boyfriend. Um, up here above, this is my like, right here is my closet and over there is my bathroom. Up here we got, she believes she could, so she did, cause that's on period, okay? And then I had like fake grass up here and on my vanity, boom. Up here, we got like a claw. This is from my dorm. I didn't know what else to do with it. It doesn't work because it doesn't have batteries in it. So it's just up there. Right here, I got Be Curious, Not Judgmental. I will forever have this in my um, apartment. I just love it. I have like three more like art stuff that didn't go up. But if y'all know something like this, I'll show y'all this up close. This is how it look. If y'all know something that's similar to that with the gold, the same size, and that type of mud, let me know. Because I'm trying to get like two or three more just like that for my next apartment. More grass things. This was like the most pretty. Well, no, everything in my room pretty pretty. But just, so I really love this. I did not know what I want to do above it. I was thinking about doing a neon sign, but I already have the lights. I have the lights around my TV. And I have my vanity mirror that light up. So just having that was probably going to be too much. And then I'll have to like run a cord all the way over here or over there. Yeah, so this will say dream until your dream come true. So I just thought that was very fitting to have above my bed. I know it's dirty, y'all, but I'm gonna clean everything up and pack stuff. But boom, and I just hang the least from off of both sides. But yes, I love this. They were like 30 bucks and you get to that gold and they were like a marble. No, I think these just plain white. So I might keep those, but we probably don't use them for bedside tables anymore. Or we probably do for like the first month. But once our bedside table come in, we won't use them. We'll probably use them for like decoration and stuff. But I really like those because it saves so much space. And it forces me to get up and go take my dishes downstairs. Or I'll put on my vanity, honestly. But it forces you to take your stuff downstairs. Boom, that's something else for my door. I just hung up here. Real queens fix each other quarrels. And also, um, this is behind all my videos. It's Halloween. So, I'm not even a person that like smoke like that. Like I really, I'm, not, I'm really not a smoker, but I think it was a black owned business. It was in the hub one year, my freshman year. And he was just selling stuff. He was like, he went all up Mississippi selling his little posters and we was his last stop. So he was like, um, he like buy a poster, you get the little sticky stuff to hang it up for free. And I just really wanted to support. I love that one. That one is really nice. I'm just gonna give that away to my boyfriend friend because it's more their style. Like they, they'll do more with it. I'm gonna get those down and I can take this. Oh. I'm done and I know a lot of people was asking me 
about my vanity, how did I build my vanity. In my apartment shopping video, I did record me saying how I need to go to Ikea to get the Alexis drawers. But the Ikea, the Ikea in Memphis sell out of everything nice so freaking quick. One day I got alerted at like, I think 8. Yeah, I think it was like 8 o'clock or like 9 o'clock that the Alexis drawers was in. And it had like 53 in stock. I was like, oh my gosh, yes. Me and my friend still get up, drove all the way out there. After me working an eight-hour shift at night, got there, they was like, it's sold out. They was like, it's sold out probably a couple minutes before y'all got here. They was like, people was lined up with their carts getting the Alexis drawers. Oh my God, we're going to be so busy and having to cry. You got to be quiet. She already took everything back. What's up, that? I don't feel like reaching it. Sonny got to get that up there. Where did I get these from? I'm so a little depressed. I got these from Michaels. Boom. Okay, like I was saying, if I was really interrupted, so I got my drawers from Michael, and all this stuff really coming to my next apartment, so I'm gonna have to say all this stuff again, but yeah, all this came from Michael, um, I got some wood cut at Home Depot, yeah, I think Home Depot cut wood, um, I just measured it, I actually got a piece cut and it was too little, and I had to go back up there, I don't think I didn't like about Home Depot in that process is that you have to buy the whole plank of wood, and then they cut it, and you bought the whole piece, so the whole piece of wood is yours. So the other piece of this wood was outside the house for L Bird, like not even kidding with y'all. With this, I just got the wood cut at this size and I put some contact paper over it, honestly. And even with my letters, y'all can tell it looked good from a distance. When you come close, you can tell that I cut it. And at the back, oh my gosh. So at the back, boom, there it's just the regular one. I just got these, I think, for Michaels also. Um, it was down there in the Yarraville, Mississippi. Got it, put some contact paper over it, and put it on my door. What else? This mirror, I think I vlogged this. If I did, then it would be in my apartment shopping video. I got this from a local Memphis furniture store. This is not the Vanity Impressions mirror. I'm saying it again. This is not the Vanity Impressions mirror. This don't even have a brand name on it. But it do... Let up, it tell you the month, day, volume, week, the temperature, child, and that's the time. And then you have Bluetooth mode connected. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's the same thing. Oh my gosh. Finally, cause this tape was not holding up. But uh, honestly, I'm gonna do like a little transformation, and I'm gonna prep everything else, and I let y'all know. I just, I just, it's just really hard to pack everything, knowing that I have to be out the house in two days and record. So I'm gonna just do anything else. I like take the nails off the wall. Um, the lights gonna stay for a minute. It's probably gonna stay till Friday. So let me do this, and I'll talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, it's the next day. I'm on the phone with Gabs. I don't think she's gonna show herself cause um, yeah. Gabs, yeah, you gonna say hello? Hey. <laughs> All right y'all, so I've done a little progress. So I mean, I'm still washing. This is my second day of washing. No, this is my third day of washing, honestly. I'm not even a cap for y'all. But it's like my third day of washing. I think I had only my white clothes left. So that's good. And my white clothes don't have to be too low because it's a lot. I packed down this. It's overpacked, but I packed it down. So maybe I can put this somewhere else because, child. I'm getting started on this closet and it's dark back here because I don't have a light in my bathroom and I don't have a light. I mean, I don't have a window in my bathroom, like natural light. And then my closet light blue and they said they're not going to fix it. So yeah, but this is the closet job. <sighs> okay. And I really just screened this out like last month. So it's really not that bad. It's really not that bad, but I'm gonna take everything from off the hangers, put it on the bed, and then hopefully my boyfriend bring me some garbage bag when he get from his camp. Um, and I'm just gonna put bags over my hangers, and we just have gonna tote that. And this gonna be this is Wednesday, so we have two more days. So we're trying to get all the clothes in order. We're trying to get 
everything off the wall, start cleaning things up, wiping stuff down, and washing everything. So that's where we at. So y'all finna out to gas. Y'all just gonna see like a sped up video of me doing this. And this is how this look, y'all. Hey, y'all. Our goal is today is to completely finish the closet, have all that thing. We'll take down my vanity today and start setting everything in its own spot downstairs. And then some stuff just gonna have to stay here, child, because I keep underestimating how much I have until it's time to move. I feel like all of us do. So yeah i'm looking rough i'm not gonna be really looking cute during this moving process this is the real deal child ain't no lashes ain't no makeup no nah. no nah, ain't no weed baby ain't no weed yeah. so in this bag right here it's so like a jimmy john a jimmy jazz child can't talk in the jimmy jazz bag i have all of my purses i think i think it's all of them i don't have many i have like 10 purses i feel like this Look at the amount for the average woman. Um, so we have that. I pack up that thing over there. And these are the bins that I had above my closet. I have one more to go through. One I'm just going to throw completely away. I threw one away because something bust inside of it. And I don't know what it is. It's like it's been there for a while. So we just not going. Yeah. But I posted this. <laughs> Boom. I posted this on my um story. My mom slid up to my son, but you don't have no clothes. Mind your business, mom. Mind your business. But other than that, I really think that's it. Everything that y'all saw is really still right here. Let me move my head. So, yeah, so them all my clothes, they have to get bags for. This some stuff that I have to fold up. And I still have like three more loads downstairs to do. So we're we're making progress. Oh. later on in the day like it's literally 12 o'clock in the morning it's gonna be one o'clock in the morning and Sunny finally got up to move my venti out and my mirror and it's literally like right there so, yeah, so i don't know what we're gonna do because my bed really don't have nowhere to go it would be completely true and i'm moving in one week so i'm like why am i gonna pay like 60 dollars for a month storage unit but i only need it for one week and they're not gonna appropriate it oh it's somehow you said i think i say appropriate i know it's probably not the word but child um so like mirror lot stuff like we gonna tuck that downstairs that's gonna be cool uh, my boss gonna be packed nicely but it's just my bed like this is the biggest thing tomorrow which is gonna be friday today we actually gonna leave here i'm gonna uh, wash all of like my bathroom stuff out we're gonna move stuff out it's getting real child this is the last second to last full night but y'all look at my room like no vanity no mirror over here i packed these clothes i don't think i showed y'all i packed these clothes up so this probably get taken down last but yeah, this is literally it. So I'm finna get up, cause he been up moving stuff. So yeah. The room set.
Um, okay, yeah, so. That nigga do with me. Um, we're not feeling it right now, so I'm going to end it here. We're going to start back up in the morning, and I'll just catch y'all up what we do tonight in the morning. Bye. Good night. Hey, y'all. Wait, things charging. How y'all doing? Um, as y'all can tell by the background, it's looking a little bit more bland, child. But today is Thursday the 20. Ninth, and today our last day like our last full day in the house tomorrow gonna be the first night we go to our friend house to spend the night so really today the best day to get all this cleared out i promise y'all i was gonna show y'all how everything looks so let me do that first and let me put my light on okay so in the hallway right this is how everything is looking. Um, again, I told y'all my vanity came apart pretty easily. We got to put some tape on like this part so it won't open when we transport it. This is the board that goes on top of it. Um, as y'all can tell, it's like really rinky dinky. You know what I'm saying? It's really not as good. But I'm gonna lay another layer of contact paper to make it look more smooth, more clean and fresh white again so these are some of the packages we had delivered um i need to wash that because we're gonna keep it the other white one that was right there i threw it away then here go my fancy mirror then my mirror and this is me and yeah oh i also need to take this off oh yeah i don't know if this vlog gonna be good child like, i really don't know I don't feel like I'm being entertaining enough, so I'm really gonna try to vlog tonight because like today is really the big day of uh, moving everything. Another thing we're gonna have tonight is the bed and the TV in the room. Everything else is gonna be out, and we probably have a toothbrush, baby, and a hot towel. That's all, and that's it. So tomorrow will definitely be the last day here for sure, for sure. But anyway, this is the last night sleeping in my bed until a whole week, a week. But I'm not gonna just do too much rambling because Sunday will probably be back in like an hour and we're gonna pick up the camera again. So I just see y'all then, okay? Okay. Yes, it is the last day in my apartment. Um, I have to say this again. My apartment vlog's not going how I thought it was gonna go, but shall we back for the last day? So tonight gonna be our first night not sleeping in here, and we don't have no furniture here. I'm gonna show you in a minute. You come out. Gaps here. Gaps. There you go. Gaps here. But yeah. So um. I got some child, some carpet and rug spot and stain remover. Y'all gonna see the little thing because again, my eyeshadow palette had dropped and wasted. So, and I had to get some sharpies because I have 
a little bit more boxes than I anticipated and we don't know what nothing is. So what I need to do is go right out of the box, what's in the box and what room to put it in. So we move in, instead of putting all um, the boxes in like the living areas, like kitchen or whatever, you take it straight where it belongs. It's gonna declutter the space quicker and then you can see what goes where um, and how much work you have based off each room and half. So yeah, this like a heck I saw, so yeah. I was like, I ain't gonna wig on y'all. Y'all finna talk about me either, okay? It's hot and I don't care. Anyways, okay, boom. Yeah, and then everything else is like right here. Now, would my apartment complex like this? No. Do I have Buku money where I can afford rent, afford new stuff, move all this stuff to a storage for a week, get a movie company, do what? No. No. So this is gonna do, we probably make it like a little bit more better. I'm gonna move all my clothes from downstairs into the truck and just have it in the truck for the week and move some of this downstairs to kind of declutter it. I threw away as much stuff I possibly can, but yeah, it didn't happen. Alright y'all, I hope y'all liked the video. I came in the closet in my new place. Ooh, not y'all got a little sticky. But yeah, I just want to do a little outro real quick. If y'all like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if y'all want to see more apartment content. Also, subscribe if you want to see the new place because it's coming, it's coming. But other than that, make sure y'all drop a comment about any videos y'all want to see from me or any ideas. I'm open to all type of content. Other than that, follow me on my meals, and I'll see y'all next time.